Who was the host of the makeover weight loss show called Revenge Body? Double pass. Which Beatles member died in 2001, leaving only two living members George behind? Harrison. In a chat room, if someone asked ASL, question mark, what are they asking specifically? Age, sex, location. In 2013, what prominent athlete admitted taking banned substances and blood doping, then was stripped of his titles? Lance Armstrong. What did oceanographer Dr. Robert Ballard locate in 1985? Titanic. Time. If you're the black sheep, your family's got real good sheep. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on, Jimmy. <laughs> is Steve back from his potty trip? He is. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. 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 Oh, he's look got at his him hand go. in his look pocket. Look at his little oh. legs go. Yeah. <laughs> Steve, welcome back. Jimmy is on hold. Thank you. How's your potty? Everything come out okay? Everything came out okay, but it was one of those like, all right, got to stop now. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Steve, your turn. Jimmy's in the books. Score and time recorded. Your turn on Dumber Than the Show Trivia begins in three, two, one. Who is the host of the makeover weight loss show called Revenge Body? Pass. Which Beatles member died in 2001, leaving only George two? George Harrison. In a chat room, if someone asked ASL question mark, what are they asking specifically? Age, sex, location. In 2013, what prominent athlete admitted taking banned substances and blood doping then was Lance stripped? Armstrong. What did oceanographer Dr. Robert Ballard locate in 1985? The Titanic? Who was the host of the makeover weight loss show called Revenge Body? Tyra Banks. Time. How'd you do? I think I got three. Jimmy, welcome back. Let's score this game. See if you are joining the family legacy or if Steve's getting out of the 100 Club, which currently has a population of one. You both passed on question one, so we'll come back to that one. Which Beatles member died in 2001, leaving only two living members behind? You both were so sure you didn't let me finish. You both said George Harrison, and you're both correct, one-to-one. -one. Which Beatles member is the one I just did in a chat room? <laughs> if someone asked ASL, what are they asking specifically? Steve said age, sex, location. Jimmy said age, sex, location. No. Both correct, and we're tied at two. I've never gotten that one. <laughs> really? <laughs> no. That, that was prime time for me. Yeah. Chat rooms. Next question. In 2013, what prominent athlete admitted taking banned substances and blood doping, then was stripped of his title? Steve said, Lance Armstrong. Jimmy said, Lance Armstrong. No. Both correct. We're tied at three. What did oceanographer Dr. Robert Ballard locate in 1985? Steve sounded like a guess when he said Titanic. Jimmy said, Titanic. Both correct. Tied at four. Who is the host of the makeover weight loss show called Revenge Body? You both passed the first time. In fact, Jimmy passed twice the first time yeah. with a DP. Oh, media. Steve came time. back and oh. said Tyra Banks. If Steve is correct, Steve wins, goes five for five, mm. and doubles his jackpot to $200. And if he's wrong, it goes to the clocks person who was the host of the makeover weight loss show called revenge body was chloe kardashian mm. <laughs> tied at four we go to the clocks <sighs> oh boy i feel like i was quick but i know he was quick too well that is true steve your instincts are correct you were both quite quick the scores or the times are very close to one another one of you will be heading into the weekend happy, and one of you will head into the weekend very sad about how close your win or your loss was. Thank you for the breakdown. <laughs> Extend it further. Extend yeah. it further. He can't take it. He's so tiny, he's going to explode any second. Paid by, the, paid by the second or the word? What was that happening? Yeah. More salad, please. <laughs> Steven? Yes. Would you like to have a happy weekend yes, or a sad I would. weekend? 
Happy, happy weekend. Would you be sad if I gave you a sad weekend? Give him a sad weekend. Yes. Make him sad, Steve. Jimmy, how do you feel about your week? Jesus. <laughs> Maybe you should just cliffhang it until Monday and just call it drunk. You know what? That's not bad. Yeah. I mean, the time, we are pushing up against it. We only have like a couple minutes left and we need to take a break. Yeah, are there any other questions you need to run by us? With a separation of two seconds, oh. roughly. Jimmy is the loser. Steve Jimmy in for the time of 31.74. Jimmy at 34, even. Oh. Wow. You suck, Jimmy. I thought Jimmy oh, had wow. you by about 10 seconds. I'm not going to lie. Oh, I would man. say Steven's only saving grace is that at least on three of those, he interrupted the question. Oh, yeah. yeah. But did yeah. you put the time penalty in for that? That's five <laughs> seconds each oh. time. Oh, sorry. Steve lost that. <laughs> well, go, go have a sad boy weekend. Hey, Jimmy. Chloe Kardashian gets me again. You know yeah. what are you going to do? Oh, my sorry, gosh. you have to move away from your family and <laughs> yeah, start a new man. job as a drifter. Shame. Oh, oh, yeah. you, are just, you are just the loser of the family. Thank yeah. you, Jimmy. Boop, boop. Boop, boop.